What's up everybody? Welcome back to Coasters and Coasters. If you're new here, thanks so much for joining us. Make sure to hit the red subscribe button and give us a thumbs up before we get started on today's video. Kogi Taqueria. our quest to find the best cheap eats in LA and that has brought us to Kogi Taqueria. Kogi is a mainstay of street food and cheap eats here in LA so let's get into the food. Kogi is known best for their street tacos. They do this amazing like fusion of Korean flavors and Mexican street tacos so we wanted to start with chicken. Let's give it a try. Mm. Messy. That's a strong start. The chicken taco is delicious. The chicken is marinated in this sweet and tangy Korean sauce. And then you've got this delicious tangy and spicy slaw on top. It's got like lettuce and I think cabbage. Really fresh, but a lot of meat packed in too. So thumbs up on the chicken. So we're called Koshers and Koshers for a reason. What's on our coaster? The beverage of the day is the Big Gulp. Diet Coke. You know what's up. Next up is the tofu taco. Now a friend of mine uh, put me onto these. They're actually really tasty. Um, so let's give it a try. So the thing about the tofu taco that's so delicious is you have this mix of textures. You've got the soft tofu, but it's all up in that Korean marinade. It's so tasty. And then you've got the fresh slaw on top. And I'm telling you, even if you're not a tofu person, give the tofu taco at Kogi a try because I'm telling you, it's tasty and it'll be a new flavor instead of textures. I bet you like it. I got the short rib taco. It looks amazing. It's a little bit more expensive than the other three tacos because it's more of a premium cut of meat. Let's give it a try. That was fantastic. It was so good. It's almost like a Korean style galbi, which is uh, the short rib, the beef, that's been marinated and grilled. This is fantastic, it's so good. So the third taco I wanted to try for you guys is my all-time favorite. It's the spicy pork taco. Let's get into it. <laughs> wow. You know, when it comes to street food, there's just something about pork. It's so flavorful. And the Kogi version of the pork taco, it is spicy like it says, but then it's got that tang and the sweetness of the Korean sauce, throw that fresh slaw on. It is a match made in heaven. Um, I could probably, if I was really going for it, eat like five of those in a row, probably shouldn't. But um, if you go to Kogi, you have to get the spicy pork taco because it is seriously delicious. Sometimes if I'm feeling really crazy, I'll take a little bit of tofu and I'll put it inside the spicy pork taco. It's good. <laughs> It's like a fusion within fusion. <laughs> Besides the taco, I got the cheese kimchi quesadilla. This is my absolute favorite thing to get at Kogi. I love it. You don't typically think of Korean food mixed with melted cheese and a flour tortilla, but it works so good. It's amazing. It comes with this kind of chili sauce to dip it in. Let's give it a taste. If 
if you know anything about me from watching these videos, you know I love spicy food. The combination of the kimchi and the cheese is amazing. It tastes so good. It's got a nice kick to it. Must get. Twisted Isaac's arm into letting me have a little bit of the, the quesadilla. <laughs> this is legit. This is so good. <laughs> We've been so excited to share Kogi Taco with you guys because it's actually a really big part of our story moving to LA. Less than a year ago, we visited LA to see if it was a place we really wanted to move to and some amazing friends brought us to Kogi. We tried it and seriously, that pretty much sealed the deal that we wanted to move here. We thought if this is what the food scene in LA is like, we want to be here for it. It's been so cool to track with Chef Roy Choi's uh, career. You know, what started as just a small fleet of taco trucks has now expanded to multiple dining locations. He's even been on TV. Uh, he starred with Jon Favreau in The Chef Show, and now he has his own show called Broken Bread. And if you're interested in digging deeper into food and life in LA, this is a really important show to watch. I would highly suggest Broken Bread to learn more about Chef Roy Choi and kind of the social justice work he's doing here in LA through food. So as Molly mentioned, we love coming to Kogi. We love this kind of food. Great flavors, Korean, Mexican, mashed up, East meets West and really delicious dishes. And just to put it in perspective for you, because this is our ongoing Cheap Eats series, everything we got was under 20 bucks. We got three regular tacos, one premium taco, and one quesadilla, and it is plenty of food for the two of us. We love this place. So we came to the truck that stays in one place on Overland, but it's worth noting that Kogi has a whole fleet of taco trucks that works its way around the LA area. So I would check their website to see if one of their trucks is in your town or in your area because it can be a big drive to come out here. So check the website. Thanks for joining us as we keep exploring LA looking for the best cheap eats. Yes, and friends, until we see you here next time, we just want to say cheers. cheers.